Very warm welcome to you all. These are the notices and the announcements for the second Sunday before Lent, Sunday the 7th of February, also known as Creation Sunday. Uh, there will be a celebration of the Eucharist today at Margam Abbey at 8.30 and 11 o'clock and a celebration of the Eucharist at St David's at 9.30. Uh, our 10 o'clock Eucharist continues on Wednesdays at Margam Abbey and St David's will be open for private prayer in the presence of the Blessed Sacrament between half past 11 and half past 12. Just a few words about Lent and how we plan to uh, mark Lent this year. On Ash Wednesday, there will be two celebrations of the Eucharist at 10 o'clock in Margam Abbey and at 12 o'clock in St David's. So that's two celebrations of the Eucharist for Ash Wednesday at 10 o'clock um, in Markham Abbey and 12 o'clock in St David's. I know we've got a couple of weeks yet, but it seems good to get that out there. Uh, unfortunately, we'll be unable to do stations in person this year in St David's because the church is simply too small for me to move around between the stations safely. Um, if you remain seated and it's not safe for us all to go around together um, with social distancing. So there will be uh, an online or virtual stations, which I will record and I will share on our YouTube and our Facebook channel. The church will remain open then um, on the uh, on Friday lunchtimes between half past 11 and half past 12 uh, for private prayer. And on the first Friday of the month, there will be our usual first Friday mass. Uh, the bishop has sent me a Lent book, Opening Our Lives, by Tristan Owen Hughes, uh, who is the vicar of <coughs> Christ Church, Roth Park, and the tutor uh, in St. Paddon's uh, College. And this is a, a daily uh, meditation and guide on a positive way of looking at Lent uh, and the Kingdom of God. And during Lent, there'll be various readings of this, which I will put online. And if you'd like to get a copy of it, um, there it is for you. So I'm sure uh, you can get that online. Uh, if you wish to read along yourself, but I will be broadcasting um, different devotions from that uh, on during the days of Lent. And other than that, uh, there's nothing much else to say. It's good to hear news of more and more people being vaccinated and having their first dose. And I'm sure you all look forward um, to having your second dose. Uh, wish you well and pray that God will bless you this day and always. <laughs>